Evening's underway. The sun is shining down on the Fox 6 Biscuit Stadium. It's the K2 Yorkshire Cup final. Let's have some Sunday afternoon fun. It's Bradford's fifth pre-season fixture of the season and we're up and away. Early doors here and it will be Batley who will move the ball out from their own try line. And for the benefit of those watching on Bulls TV and listening on Bulls Live, let's not forget that the Rugby Football League new rules will be applied this afternoon. The players and spectators, they will be exposed to Rugby League's new on-field rules for 2019. Uh, pre-season matches being played today and that includes the K2 Yorkshire Cup final here at Batley so the shot clock changes they will place time limits on Batley and Bradford at the goal line dropouts and the scrums with the referee Tom Grant in direct link up with the match commissioner and timekeepers new rules aim to speed up the game so it's a clean set of six from that left hand edge and uh, Bradford just getting a little bit ahead of steam here as Oaks will play the ball outside the 20 and they're going to have a huge strong tilt towards the line here now the Bradford Bulls they're 12 metres out coming down the slope in the first half four minutes gone Mikey Wood can't get past Dave Scott and that's the last tackle eight metres away on that last tackle in front of the post Milnes crossfield kick looking for Ethan Ryan Ethan Ryan touches the ball down but he's just got dead in goal and it will be a tap on the 20 so Brown on tackle number one it'll now go to Leek to Gledel to Bram Burney Bram Burney to Joe Frey Joe Frey to Galbraith Galbraith scored a try in last week's semi-final that 22-18 win over the York City Knights here come Batley looking for first points Manny towards the corner Manny's been dragged into touch sensational defence there from Hitchcock's big Chella and Pickers Gill Jufre out of dummy half Batley just moving it on this right hand edge John I think we'll get we've got a set of six for a bit of a breather and a bit of reflection on where this game's going at the moment yeah, I think, I think to be fair, Mick, it's, it's, a, it's a really tight game. You know, just at the minute, you know, through penalties, you know, through repeat sets, they've just had the edge. Oh, oh it's picked oh. off here. Ross Oaks has intercepted the ball. And Ross Oaks will touch down five metres to the left-hand side of the post. Johnny Campbell comes in. The referee, Tom Grant, looks. Oaks was onside. He retreated back the ten. And he took this pass, sweet as you like as Milnes will try this conversion attempt five metres to the left hand side of the post this to give the Bulls the extra two points Milnes no mistake Bulls TV, Bulls live Mick Gledel, John Bastian your call team this afternoon Lily to Minchella the space on the right hand edge Minchella inside the Batley 10 upended by Manning last tackle says Tom Grant it goes to Lily Lily's pass picked up by Campbell Campbell's away has Campbell got enough to? He beats Flanagan. He's not going to beat Rowan Mills. And Rowan Mills comes in with James Green for good measure. The danger's not over yet for the Bulls. Someone's going for 10 minutes and they're not, they're not. Because James Green and Rowan Mills, they've come up with a bell ringer. Johnny Campbell's lost the ball on... Con minutes remaining as Brambani gets a quick play of the ball in and we go back down the middle with James Brown. James Brown sucks in Flanagan, offloads the ball. Lewis Jufre past Mills, can't get past Farrell and Farrell makes amends there with that tackle. Try saving tackle on Jufre for his earlier error. They're going to try brute force and crash over the line. Jack Downs is over but Jack Downs is held up over the line. Scrambling defence from Ethan now in 2000. 2019, 20 seconds remaining, Bradford on the last, George Flanagan has took one to the face, it's on him back play, the referee though will say it was legal, he'll say it was on the shoulder first, it did end up in the face, that's what's got the Bulls supporters animated in this made stand sound, the hooter will sound with Campbell being brought down by Evans and here we go, it's on, there's punches, it's a 23 man Arlen. and the hooter sound here John and this is all on the back off of John Flanagan taking one to the face in back play. Yeah, I think the referee got that shove in and then it, a few players just move in and then there's a few... I don't think there's a lot in it, Mick. I won't be sending any players off or, or sim. You might sim bin them, but I won't send any players off for a, a, you know a little scuffle like that. George Flanagan has been sent to the sim bin by referee Tom Grant. So to Dean Manning. So Manning. minutes of the second half. Bradford lead six points to nil. 
and Bradford will be going up the slope in this second half and John a lot of people always say the slopes worth a couple of try lead Bradford are going to have to do it tough in this second half yeah I, I'll, I'll go for that Mick a little bit but so, I think early pressure now for the Bulldogs Leak Brambani Jouffray Jake Webster flies out of that defensive the attack but the ball's out it goes to Galbraith to Campbell Campbell back on the inside to Galbraith Galbraith towards the Bradford line a metre out fourth tackle gone we've had 90 seconds at the start of the second half incessant pressure from the Bulldogs going down the slope remember Campbell's pinch one from dummy half the referee Tom Grant awards the try the time again drawing that imaginary line and this one will go between the posts. We're locked up. Six points apiece. Webster out of dummy half. It's going to go back there towards Wildy. Wildy now in the halves with Lily. Controlling that direction and flow. And he's going to link with Lily across the face of the post. Lily towards the line. But Manny Wildy's been taken out. A late shoulder charge there on Manny Wildy. The touchdown straight on here. Batley could be in trouble. Tom Grant is going to the back pocket. It was a late shoulder charge on Manny Wilde. And it's going to be Toby Everett who sees 10 minutes in the bin. So a crucial period of this game now. And the referee has just put Batley on the team warning as well for good measure. Three quick penalties they've conceded. It was a late challenge off the ball. He's not agreeing with the decision, Toby Everett, but he'll take his place in front of our commentary position. And Bradford now, another set of six. James Green towards the line! It's like Keith Canoe trying to stop the waves! But James... Five minutes, Toby Everett sent to the Simbin for a late ta tackle on Manny Wilder. Here goes Jordan Lilly. Jordan Lilly trying to pirouette his way past the Batley defence. Gets the quick play of the ball in. Can they stop the surge of George Flanagan? George Flanagan attacking Galbraith and Smeaton. And the referee is... Here we go, John Magrin's involved. It's on again, John. Penalty to the Bulls here. The ball here now, you know, from the kickoff, And we can get to a kick, a strong chase, and start turning them round up this big hill. Because it, it'll be down to the team that's the fittest in the last 20 minutes that's going to win this game. From the, the, the side at the top end, defending... It takes a lot of gas out of those boys. It's a loose pass from Lilly. He's picked up from Wayne Retty. Retty has Manny Wildy in pursuit. Retty towards the line. Retty takes a tumble. Wildy drops on Retty. Tackle complete. Ten metres out from the Bradford line. Scott in there at dummy half. The danger not over. Batley have the ball stretched. He's out to Manning. Manning's brought down on the left edge. Five metres away from the line. Lewis Jouffre. He's held up by Mikey Wood. The ball's been lost. <laughs> Mikey Wood. An absolute try saving tackle. To get numbers there. And they've come up with an error. Let me just tell you, that was electrifying rugby league football. Although in the background something has happened outside the tackle and the referee is going to send. We're waiting to see what colour the card is. It's yellow. And Brandon Pickersgill. Brandon Pickersgill will be sent to the Simbing. And Batley, they're also going to be reduced now to 11 men. Referee Tom Grant is sending Lewis Galbraith off. So Lewis Galbraith in the sim bin with George Flanagan. It's not Brandon Pickersgill. So George Flanagan's going for his second spell in the sim bin. And we've now got 11 on 12. Yeah, it's good. It's good, Mick. It's good. You know, we're still in a really good place. You know, just a little bit, little bit. That doesn't help. That doesn't help. Just conceded a penalty there, and you know, off the back there, you know, of a, a, a poor end to a set, you know, with the kick, you know, going out on the fall from Jordan Lilly. Then we concede a penalty, and now we're under pressure a little bit, and we've got to be. Of the real. second half from the far stand side. This a centre field position is giving an almighty hoof. Has it got the distance? It's just dropped under the crossbar, and Ethan Ryan's going to return the kick. 
Here goes Ethan Ryan. It's past Meaton and Hemingway in a two-man tackle. Quick play of the ball back to Wilde to Magrin. Magrin dumped on his shoulder. That was an absolute barnstorming tackle there from Dane Manning. It's the last tackle for the Bulls. It goes to Lilly, to Pickersgill, to Webster. Ryan, Ethan Ryan. Can he get it down in the corner? Ethan Ryan with a try. And the Bradford and The full allocated minute allowed after a try is scored Jordan Lilly this to really bring the house down you feel it's there it's there Bradford lead by two clear scores yeah. out of dummy half finds Gledel Gledel brought down by Green and Milton in a two man tackle it's going to go back with Mikey Ward towards the line the Bulldogs are brought down a metre shy of the line Hemingway's in there at dummy half he's going to go left towards Brambani Brambani's over for the Bulldogs Brambani will go past three sevens and Manny Staunton is 10 points to 14 Smarter there we just left some holes and that's just a little bit of concentration and the numbers being correct Dave Scott converts from just to the left hand side of the tackle for the Bradford Bulls as Lilly goes for Brock. Lilly keeps it going. It's the power play. The Bulls are away. We started. Started to Evans. Evans inside the 20. The kick ahead to Jufre. Jufre still tackling his heart out. Connor Farrell comes in as the second marker. Bartley look for the 40 20 from Brambani. He's been charged down by Milton. They're going for the 40 20. It's over the head of Ethan Ryan. Ethan Ryan has palmed it back in the field of play. Miracle stuff from Ethan Ryan. That looked all but certain. Out to sound. Jordan Lilly finds touch. This will be the final play. There will be one final play here. This game has had just about everything. It goes to Lilly. Lilly rolls the ball over the mid stab touchline. Full time here at Mount Pleasant. The Bradford Bulls, the winners of the 2019 K2 Yorkshire Cup final.